keep organized chaos. Two racks I can keep. Hey everyone, my name is Lera and I'm a crew member on a cruise ship. Currently I'm in Oasis of the Seas and today I want to share with you three different types of cabins in these cruise ships. I will show you a shared cabin. It's really typical cabin. Most of the crew members living in the cabins like that. Then I will show you a single shared cabin. It's a little bit different and uh, private cabins and unfortunately it's not so many of them here on the ship. And in the end I will show you a couple's cabin which is my cabin. I really hope you will like this video and if you do please don't forget to subscribe my channel. I'm showing a crew member's life behind the scene. Let's watch the comments. Welcome to the... <laughs> Where do we live? <laughs> 41557, welcome to our room. Up here is my really nice bed. I have a nice mattress topper on here, as you can see, because the beds here are very comfortable. Back here, I have this really nice shelf connecting to this cord that's plugged in on my desk so that I can use my phone charger up here. Here's another beautiful decoration shelf that we have. Keep the headbands, the sunglasses, the shot glasses that have never been used, but they're from Costamaya and I had to buy them. And my perfume here. This is our picture wall where we <laughs> drunkenly decide to take pictures with our friends. <laughs> and then we have some really nice hooks to keep the hats and all of the extra bags on. And you have a shoe rug there. Check out our beautiful storage. Also, we have shelves here. I like these. They're so nice. Yes. A couple more hooks. Staples in here <laughs> for the bags and jackets. Oh, you find some ducks? We got an Irish one and a laughing emoji one. I think they're perfect. The top section, she's kind of messy right now, but also organized chaos is mine. I keep craft supplies and stuff for parties in this one and then this is basically everything else cosmetics show stuff another binder because i need 10 of them apparently <laughs> and then sandra's area if you want to talk about your i area. don't have idea what is there i'm just like putting everything it's, okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's my time <laughs> and it's our fridge uh we don't have a lot of stuff here but it's okay Coffee creamer will always yeah. be found in my fridge. Well, four more here, two for Kali, two for me. Mm -hmm. Those are my snack drawers. It's my bed. I really like your sheets. So nice. And I have one more blanket, if it will be cold. <laughs> And the TV. You have a TV for each. Yes, mm -hmm. we have TV for each, but we on the side don't use it. I use my laptop. This is my gray my... blanket that I brought with me. This is a blanket I bought in New York. This is my full size comforter, if you're wondering. <laughs> it's just a little bit too big for the bed, but I'm never getting cold up here. And I have a nice silk pillowcase that I bought for myself, too. We bought for ourselves this shelf because um, we don't have enough space space for all our clothes because this is room for two of us and this is just for everything just for one person for one person and really you don't have enough space yeah Lyra is so happy because Mario don't have enough clothes and oh, yeah. she have like a room for just Lyra's clothes we don't <laughs> have like this when it's two girls living yes that's yeah. hard <laughs> I, oh good luck and also we have magnets like this we put in our schedule. Add a little decorations. Yes. Just picked up those travel size containers. It's okay. Thank you so much, girls. You look at us do with it. Bye. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> 
cops and go in. Wow, it's so clean. <laughs> come in. <laughs> so this is the single shared cabin on Oasis of the Seas. You've got your bed up here, which is a pull down bed. And it can be kind of annoying because of that. <laughs> so you kind of wake your neighbors up every time you pull down your bed. So you need to be like oh. really sure, like, okay, I need it up or I need it down. And then it goes back up to tuck away and it reveals your desk area. You got a few desks and whatnot, a few drawers for storage. Is it a fridge? mini fridge here. Yep. Just big enough for like some chocolates some water bottles, things like that, a couple of beers. Not too big, but big enough. Um, I like to keep my laundry in here just because it keeps it out of sight, out of the way, it keeps the smell yeah. kind of away. And yeah, you got some closet storage space right here. It's not too big, but I make it work. I got like a shoe rack so I can keep shoes here. You can keep probably 20 shirts or so. There's also storage space up here. I mostly just keep extra boxes, extra linens, extra towels, things like that. And then over here, I got all the toiletries, lotions, deodorants, lots of acetaminophen and pain pills, so much of that. Definitely the eye drops, because sometimes the water just kills your eyes. So it's small, but you try and make the work best of, you know, of the space that you have and try and organize things as best as you can. And you have a sink right beside your bed. The sink <laughs> is right beside your bed, which is so inconvenient, <laughs> but like I said, you have to make it work as best you can because the bathroom is not very spacious. Pretty much tiny. just oh enough room to sit down. <laughs> it's so tiny. It's really it's small. It's like twice smaller than our bathroom. You're always touching some side of the... Ew. Some side. <laughs> Ew. It's like, you want to touch the curtain? You want to touch the wall? Something's going to happen. And then we have the shared bathroom with another guy who has the identical layout, but opposite on Is the Buster other side. He has, but he's still sleeping right now. Yeah, he here is another door. door for Busties. Let's see. Yeah. Um, I actually like single shirts, they're so cute. It's one TV. Nice. It's mostly best to watch it in the bed because yeah, the bed because... kind of blocks it <laughs> when it's up. You're yeah, you can't TV. really enjoy the TV and like draw or do paperwork. It's like you're either in your bed watching TV you're either one thing or you're down one here. Other. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Try and keep everything organized because as you can see, it can get messy really fast. Yes. Just like a few things and it looks like a bomb exploded. Luckily, I brought a lot of duffel bags, so they packed up small some people had really hard case suitcases I feel like the duffel bags were a much better option so because it gets like a lot like even now I have no leg room like if I sit here it's like <laughs> like there's nowhere to go yeah. but the, the desk, desk is, is really huge. big yeah which is nice usually this becomes like the chill area you've got like four different people just sitting along the desk hanging out in here chilling so thank you so much of friend. course thank thanks you. for coming by I appreciate it <laughs> And here's my cabin. When you open the door, here on the side, I have all the important information that we usually need. It's uh, our rotation for cleaning the backstage and spotlight. That's a captain calendar with, with all the ports. Here's also all the ports, our schedule, and the master rotation. Also, we have here our name tags. Last year, we also was using this smile behind the mask because we was using masks all the time. Thank God we're not using that anymore. <laughs> but I just have it here, just in case. Here we have a shoe rug. I think this is the first thing that I'm buying every time when I'm coming to a concert because it's so so good you can put all your shoes I also putting a lot of little things because I don't know where to put it it's really really handy for uh, small spaces like this one then we have here a little corner 
with the uh, hats and the bags and my blow dryer here also i have a bag for plastic bags and cans for trashing that because we always need to separate it here is the garbage bin and our laundry basket this thing i steal from previous cabin it's actually really nice to have some extra storage i think if i will not steal that from previous cabin i'll probably buy that in target and here we have a fridge it's really small but i really appreciate that we have it because in the beginning of the contract our fridge was broken it's really not nice when you don't have even a fridge because all the time have your sodas and some sauces and yogurts and everything i'm like i need my snacks like i'm i'm not feeling comfortable if i don't have any food beside me <laughs> also we have a storage here if you watch my previous video with the same cabin but on harmony we didn't have this storage we had uh, actually fridge here so it's this cabin have a little bit more storage than the previous one here's my favorite part is the shelf with the snacks with my teas i just have a million teas here and here i have a basket full of snacks because again i just i can't leave without food here we have a tv and this clock i also steal from the previous cabin i feel like it's a really nice clock we never had a clock before in the cabin but that's actually really helpful <laughs> my hats the lights as i say before this is the main reason why we even apply for this cabin because is the normal bed not a bunk bed like i show you in a shared cabin this is just amazing anyone who was living in a bunk bed know that that this is a privilege we have a little shelf here also i always have water here and my kindle here i put another hook also hooks is one of the best thing for for small spaces like this one hooks magnets and a shoe rack i always 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 buy that when i'm arriving to a ship here we have a closet this is mine and this is mario's i <laughs> finally cleaned it right before i record this video and it's kind of clean now this thing is also really helpful i just roll my pajamas and tops and things like that and put it here and it's it's good also there is another little difference with the uh, couples coming from harmony here we have a uh, three drawers not two and it's also super super nice and above the closet we have some space and i just put a box here with all the things for my hair and it's also a blow dryer and my makeup bags this is also so good i feel like these cabin have so much more storage than a harmony one and yeah we have here a mirror i really like this mirror watching that every day checking before going to work if i'm not looking crazy i'm always looking crazy here is the bathroom here is a lot of storage behind the mirrors one more shelf all our things another shelf and here's the things for cleaning of course of course beer opener like in the last cabin it's classic i put here extra two hooks for my towels people before us leave this shower head thank you so much for that because water on the ship is really harsh and this shower head is helping a little bit it's small it's really really small like it's tiny and every time when you're oh it's rocky and every time that you're taking a shower you're always touching the curtain always <laughs> That's it, that is three different types of cabin on uh, Oasis of the Seas. Let me know what do you think about each of the cabin. I actually really, really like a single cabin. If I will not have a couple, I will definitely want to live in a single cabin. But when you live in a shared cabin, it's also good because there is more space. And if you're lucky and you have a good 
roommate you became really close to them and you became really good friends and you have so many stories i really want to say thank you to all my friends who let me record their cabins please show them some love they let us into their personal space so please be kind and leave in the comment in which kind of cabin you will like to try to leave and for how long you can live in this cabin because this contract we have 10 months yeah we're living 10 months in a space like this you think you're capable to do that as of my cabin i really love this cabin and i try to make it cozy at least a little bit feeling like home i know that mario probably don't care about any of that about not light about nothing but i really i really want to feel like home because most of the time we're on a cruise ship so and i'm just trying to make our space already feeling nice i want to say that the couples that experience this kind of life like living in this close space i feel like it's really strong couples because like even in the morning if somebody from us wanted to brush the teeth we need to do it one by one and we have most of the time the same schedule so we're waking up at the same time in the morning i'm not the best person <laughs> i'm super grumpy it's just so little space thank you so so much for watching this video and i hope you really like it and don't forget to subscribe me and leave me a comment what do you think about all of this and i hope to see you in the next one <sighs> right now it's like it's three 30 a.m. I just didn't have any other time to record this.